So Antonio, we've seen we've seen some of the fighters. You know, we've we've done the draw for the main event. We've seen the sort of uh, I sort of just build it there as the co-main event. Uh, we've got the the juniors on. We've got the young lads making their debuts. We've got some characters on the card. Just tell us, you know, what fight what fight are you looking forward to? Um, me personally, I am looking forward to the heavies. Then again, we to be fair, it's I'm looking forward to all of the fights. Like I know it's but. The heavies, there is a lad who isn't here with us today, and he is from Swindon. His name's August. If anyone is from Swindon and has been about the boxing scene, you might be, you might know August, and you know what August brings. And August will be definitely bringing fireworks Friday night, I'm sure. But his opponent, Jamie Payton, I'm yes. told to believe that is definitely no stranger to a ring and uh, is ready to fire some fireworks back. I'm glad Antonio mentioned that because, you know, August, we're talking about the boxers and, you know, he's probably the most highly decorated boxer on this card. He's an ex-amateur boxer, very highly skilled. I couldn't put him against a normal white-collar fighter. You can't do that. He's against Jamie Patton, who, who's he recently been sparring at Tony Borg's gym, you know, with, with uh, you know, professional boxers. That's the sort of calibre he's got a mix with. He's He recently fought my the tank promotions like lightweight champion, Alfie Connolly. He was on the wrong end of a points loss, but Alfie is phenomenal. You know, it's um, that's uh, so credit to you. You know, not only have you got guys that are having their first fight, you've got some real talent on there. And yeah. so, if you know August, you know he's a barber at Platinum ba Hairdressers, yep. Platinum or, Barbers, or Platinum Barbers. Um, go and see him. You know, he's uh, he needs your support, like all the boxers. Yep, uh, like Rich said, we have all got tickets available, so if anyone does need tickets, please go and see any of the fighters directly, any of their gyms that they're fighting out of, they'll be able to put you in the right way, or failing to do so, come and shout us direct and we'll be able to sort you out. And whilst we've got a good few people in the room, have we got any, is there any questions from anyone in the, you know, here watching? Has anyone got anything to, they want to ask us, or ask Antonio, or ask anything at all about the event? Anyone got any questions? Yes. Right, yeah? We'll talk off camera about the children's young man. Thank you very much. Anything related to any fights they're looking forward to? Any uh, any future shows? Because you are going to go again, Antonio, aren't you? Yep. So the um, the plan was for obviously mixed combat promotions to be a platform for mixed combat. We could only water with a can we had at the minute. So the show must go on. We have presented a night of boxing, but we re we actually reached out to you did as well, Rich. So a lot of the gyms in our local area that maybe might be involved in MMA or whatever mixed combat it might be, we gave everyone enough notice. Um, unfortunately, we couldn't get any on on this show, but. For our next show, which we're looking forward to towards the end of October, hopefully. Booked. Yep, we're booked. And then, um, yeah, hopefully then we can carry on with our idea and give you a mixed night of combat, you know? Talking about that, you had Darren Jones there and his opponent talking about potentially bare knuckle. Would it be worth, like... If Darren Jones and Sam want to box hybrid boxing, they're more than happy to do so on my show. Let me, I, I mean, on this one, it is going to be gloved. Yeah. Because obviously there is, we all, I I said to Antonio, I want to stick to sort of some, you know, guidance, and it will be a gloved event. This one, any future shows, you know, I'm sure he he yeah, sort that out for sure. Are we good? Thanks everyone for coming out on Father's Day, and um, thanks, much appreciated. If anyone's got any, if anyone's got any ticket money because he needs to get some stuff in, please see Antonio. And um, if you need any more tickets, we we got tickets, yeah, right? Tickets Thanks very much.